okay, just got to White Pine Lake. Gonna find myself a camp, get things set up and uh, settle in. Yeah, so 5.3 miles, 2,500 feet of elevation gain. Great day on trail. Okay, we got camp set up and uh, the lake's just right out there, packs in the tree. There's a family that's camped over there from me, but uh, I'm not too worried about it. I kind of figured it's a weekend in the Wasatch and things are busy here in Utah now. So I've had a little bit of thunder. Uh, we might get a thunderstorm here. We'll see what happens. It seems to be like kind of breaking up in pieces, but uh, I've got the rain jacket on and uh, everything's ready to go in the tent in case uh, that happens. So I'm going to put my fishing rod together and do some fishing. So we'll talk to you in a bit. Okay, quick tour camp here. Here's my firewood for the night. Just harvested all that. You can have a fire at white pine. You cannot have a fire at red pine. So, and uh, this is where my shelter is. Kind of tucked back in here. Not a lot of spaces. It's pretty busy in here tonight. There's a lot of campers, but uh, we got a kitchen rock and stuff. So that's great. And uh, really happy to be here. Okay, well, we're set to go for the evening. Um, I tried some fishing for about an hour. Um, there's just no rises or strikes or anything going on on the lake right now and you can see a lake behind me there so maybe i'll go back out and try again i was going to cook some dinner here i'm getting hungry um that was a long haul today a little over five miles 2500 feet of elevation gain but uh nice to be here the thunderstorms have finally broken so uh yeah it's uh the wildflowers this year are unbelievable so if you haven't made it up the cottonwood canyons here and you're in salt lake and you haven't seen these wildflowers yet you need to get after it so we're gonna go make some dinner. We'll check you soon. some rises on the lake and I went down and tried my hand at fishing but uh yeah still nothing so uh so get my fire going here and get ready for the night uh, try to shoot a star trail I'll get up in the morning and get after him
Well, top of the morning to you, it's day two here at White Pine Lake and uh, went out and fished. I had one bite, but he didn't take it. Bunch of rises. Um, yeah, that's just how it goes sometimes. <laughs> I tried, tried my damnedest, but uh, yep, sometimes you just uh, end up without a fish and that's okay. Um, I'm gonna have some breakfast, change clothes, pack it up, hit the trail, head home. It's been fun overnight. I had a good night's sleep last night. Um, went to bed about 11.30, got a star trail, tried some astrophotography with the new iPhone. I've got a lot of work to do to learn how to use this thing, but I've only had it five days, so I'm not going to kick myself too hard. So going to get things moving. We'll check in with you before we go. Okay, all packed up and ready to go. It's about 9.30. I'm going to throw the pack on, hit the trail, start heading down, get home, see my family. Um, you know, a great overnighter. I wish the fishing would have been better. You know, um, I did have one strike. I just didn't get it. Bunch of rises. Um, they're really slow in here. You know, um, that's just how it goes sometimes. So, uh, um, good night last night, though. Had a great fire. Got some star trails. You know, really, for an overnighter, you can't beat it. Plus, uh, you know, this is a nice conditioning hike. Five miles each way. You know, gets the legs going. I haven't been out for a couple of weeks. I took a couple of weeks off. And uh, so this was nice to kind of get me back in the action. So I'm going to hit the trail. We'll talk to you soon. All right, White Pine Lake. Till next time. It's been beautiful to be back. We will come visit again soon. Beautiful little waterfall going on over there. I didn't see that on the way in. That is gorgeous. <laughs>